the muscular system. Do you know how organs of the muscular system work together? Well, if you touch your cheek, legs, palms, arms, fingers, and stomach, those fleshy parts are called muscles. Some muscles are hard while others are soft. Your bones are covered with muscles. The combination of skeletal system or bones and muscles that works together is also known as musculoskeletal system. Muscles allow us to move. Although, bones are joined in different ways to allow movement. Bones cannot move without the muscles that are attached to them. All the muscles in the body make up the muscular system. Take a look at these activities involving using of muscles. A muscle is consists of fibers or muscle cells that are held together. Some muscles are large while some are long, some are small and others are short. Your muscles make up 40% of your total weight. Now, Let's see how muscles are connected to the bones. Take a look at this muscle. There is a tough cord which is attached to the bone. This cord that connects the muscle to the bone is called tendon. Tendons are made up of tough fiber of proteins called collagen. When the muscles contract, the tendon pulls the bone, causing it to move. Did you know that your face has 50 muscles? You use 17 muscles to smile. But you use more than 46 muscles to frown. So, which do you think is more relaxing to do, smiling or frowning? Now let us describe how muscles work. There are more than 600 muscles in our body that performs different type of actions. All muscles have common characteristics. Muscles can contract and become short. You do this to make your bone and body move. After contraction, muscles can relax and return to their original length. Muscles react to the signals from the brain. Now, let's see how the muscles on your arm work. When you bend your arm, the muscles work in pairs, either pulling or relaxing. This is the biceps and triceps. Biceps and triceps are the long muscles in the upper arm. When you bend your arm, the biceps contract, while the triceps relax. The biceps pull the bones of the lower arm. 
when you put your arms down, the triceps contract and the biceps relax. The biceps and triceps work as pair, and the bones and muscles work in coordinated way. There are three types of muscles. The cardiac muscles. The smooth muscles. And the skeletal muscles. The cardiac muscles are involuntary muscles present only in the heart. Cardiac muscles allow the heart to contract rhythmically and continuously. But still, you cannot control the beating of your heart. Smooth muscles. These are involuntary muscles. These muscles cannot be controlled consciously. These muscles are found in the digestive system like esophagus, stomach, and intestines. These muscles keep on moving at all times. Number 3. Skeletal Muscles Skeletal muscles are voluntary muscles that are consciously controlled to move the bones. It is responsible for all kinds of movement. Skeletal muscles make up the large part of the arms, legs, chest, and abdomen. You can make these muscles move when you want them to move. Your body has bones and muscles that work together with the help of joints, ligaments, and tendons. Now that you know how muscular system work, you also need to know and practice the helpful habits that promote proper functioning of the muscular system. You should do the following. Eat a balanced diet. Whole grains, vegetables, fruits, and lean protein are needed to keep your muscular system healthy. Next is you have to exercise. Do 30 minutes of cardiovascular exercise a day. Swimming, running, dancing, and aerobics increase blood circulation and allowing efficient delivery of nutrients to the muscles. Well, you also need to take a rest. Muscles should be relaxed after hard work activity to regain strength. 